afternoon sir, good afternoon classmates. So, I'm Marnie Lapis Jr., your reporter for today. So, my report is all about the professional purpose. Uh, professional is tells about how you going to be a professional. What are some purpose of being professional? So, let us proceed to my PowerPoint. All kind of professional writings have special purpose related to the workplace settings. One purpose is to record important workplace information. For example, the minutes of your meetings. Or for example, we have conduct special meetings. So we need to keep some notes or minutes of a meeting secretarial note or some secretarial note is the minutes of the meetings and other document another purpose is to give or ask for information from people within the company via memos outside the companies via business letters or either of the to be a professional report. Another purpose is to persuade readers to take action, be a fee, buy something, accept change, give someone a job, and etc. This purpose can be seen in professional proposals, marketing or promotional materials and job application letters. A professional document may also be written with all three purposes in mind, just as a resume which records a person's skills and professional achievement, give information about this and persuade a prospective employer to hire him or her based on this so we know that resume is full of information of the applicant another additional purpose tied to the third is to build an individual or a company's positive image establish rapport essential to build goodwill so the next is the we know the some purpose of professional is to give a good image of our company. So that's all and let's me see the how we how can we be a professional. It's not easy to be a professional but we need to be a professional. So thank you and God bless us all.